Hi, I am Ram Gopal from PresentationProcess.com. In this video, you will learn how to create an attractive 3D text effect in PowerPoint 2013. The 3D text effect you will learn to create today looks like this. And this beautiful. You can use this awesome effect to create beautiful looking cover slides or title slides for your business presentations. Let me show you how easy it is to create these beautiful looking 3D text effects from scratch. Here I am on a new slide and the first thing I'm going to do is to write the text to which I'm going to apply the 3D text effect. So let us go to Auto Shapes menu. Under Basic Shapes, I'm going to pick up this text box tool and I'm going to write Prezo Training. What is Prezo Training? Prezo Training is one of our websites, www.prezotraining.com. And by the way, we also have a very useful PowerPoint related YouTube channel called Prezo Training Website. You can always search for this in YouTube and you'd be able to find Prezo Training Website YouTube channel. I post daily PowerPoint tutorials in Prezo Training Website YouTube channel. Anyway, now let us see how exactly to apply the 3D text effect to the text here. I'm going to cut this out to make it much shorter so you can really see the effect in full proportions. So I'm going to first choose a thicker font, maybe something like Arial Black would do. So let me go down here and choose Arial Black and I'm going to really make it big so you can see the effect completely. Now with this done, we are going to apply the 3D text effect. So let me select the text box here, right click and go to Format Shape and go to the text options here. Don't make the mistake of working with shape options because that's not really going to affect the way the text looks. So we need to work with text options here. Go to the option called text effects and you will see a number of options here. We are going to choose the one called 3D format and we are going to change the top bevel. So I'm going to apply the first bevel preset called as circle and you can see that the effect is applied but it is still not visible because the font color we chose doesn't allow us to clearly see the effect that we have applied just now. So let me go to the format tab under drawing tools in PowerPoint ribbon, go to the text fill and choose something lighter. Maybe a lighter font color like orange would be just right and maybe even I can remove the outline for this text here. Now we are beginning to notice the impact of the 3D bevel text effect that we have applied to this text. Now I'm going to do some experimentations and I'm going to make some changes here and you can see the impact of these changes on this text here. So I'm going to increase the font size first so the effect is far more pronounced. Now the font size of this is 115 and let us now make some changes to the top bevel. As you can see here, the default width and height is three points each and that is not really making much of an impact on the text here. If I want the effect to be visible, then I really need to increase the width and height in this 3D format. And here I'm going to increase the width to 20 points and then I'm going to change the height to 10 points. Now as you can see, as soon as I made these changes, the impact on the text is clearly visible. Now I'm going to make a few changes here. Instead of using the cliched Arial Black, I'm going to use a different font that will make the effect look even more awesome. So I'm going to go to the font group here. I'm going to choose a different font called Bohas 93. This is a font that I downloaded from the net. And you can see that immediately the effect is far more interesting. Maybe I can make it slightly bigger so it's very clearly visible. I'm going to change the font color to make it look even more awesome. So I'm going to choose a bright one like this. And now you can see that the impact is even better. The best part is you can play with the various uh, effects here under material and lighting to make this look even more awesome. For example, under material, I can click and select the special effect option here by clicking on this one called as dark edge. And immediately you can see that there is a nice little sheen on the text. Now I can go back to the top bevel and I can change the bevel type from circle to angle and immediately the effect is far different and far more attractive. I can go change the text fill to orange and now it is beautiful. Now the main thing is, if I want to write some other text, 
like say I pick up the text box and say I'm going to write some other text. I can apply the same format to that one as well. All I need to do is to select this, go to Format Painter under Home tab and I can click on the target text and immediately you can see that the same formatting is applied. So once you create a few of these effects which you like, then you can use them as a template and use the Format Painter to apply them to any of the text that you want. So that is something that I want to want you to remember. Then finally, let us try and add some shadow effects like go here, shadow and apply some kind of shadow presets and now you can see the effect pops out even more. So in all, if you want to make a real impact with your text, there are a few important leverages you have. The first one is the size of the font. Second is the type of font that you use. Third is the font color you use. And fourth is the 3D text effect that you use. That is, when you select this and go to text options, the kind of bevel option that you use has an impact on how your text looks and the width and height of the bevel that you apply, the material and lighting, everything has its effect on making your text look attractive. I hope I gave you a small hint about the possibilities that are available in terms of working with text effects. If you liked the clarity of my explanation and the creativity of the effects that I have been showcasing all the while in Presentation Process channel, then you will really love our Ram Gopal's PowerPoint Mastery program. It is a structured way to master PowerPoint. Ram Gopal's PowerPoint Mastery program is arguably the most comprehensive and creative PowerPoint training online. You can find more details about Ram Gopal's PowerPoint Mastery program by clicking on the No More button here. And by the way, I hope you liked the tutorial that I taught you in this video. If you did, then I have a wonderful treat for you. I have put together a beautiful mini training called Learn 25 Creative PowerPoint Ideas to make your slides slick and interesting. If you're a business presenter, like say you are a business owner, a business executive, a trainer or a consultant, then you will find this course extremely useful. You can sign up for this mini training by clicking on the button here. You can also sign up for the mini training by clicking on the link in the description area below this video. So go ahead, click on the button here, sign up for the mini training and take your business presentation slides to a whole new level. I'll see you inside the mini training.